welcome to London. Welcome to the History Lord Channel. You join me here once again in my den in the east of London. Now today I'm going to talk about a local Grade 2 listed building which is actually a cricket pavilion. It's been a pavilion, or been a cricket ground, since 1885 and uh, it was originally the home to Essex County Cricket Club. The uh, cricket club themselves were formed in uh, 1876 and uh, after an advertisement was placed in a local newspaper and they uh, formed there, they used to play their home matches in Brentwood. But in 1885 they were looking for a, a new bigger ground and they came to Leighton. They bought the ground for £12,000. And the first match there was in June, on the 15th and 16th of June 1885, and that was against Surrey. Sadly, I don't know the result of that one. They turned to first-class cricket, as we know it today, in 1894. And the first match at the Leighton County Ground was against Leicestershire. And again, sadly, I don't know the result of that, but never mind. It was in 1895 that a different sport arrived at the county ground for a one-off match, and that was a football match between Woolwich Arsenal, who were south of the river, and then eventually migrated to Highbury, north of the river, and they played uh, Leicester Fossey. Uh, the reason that the match was played at the county ground in Leighton was because the manor ground in Woolwich was uh, out of bounds, because uh, Arsenal's previous matches had a few little bits of crowd trouble. I see uh, that lasted well into the 70s and 80s, but never mind, never mind. Now, the ground itself had a capacity of 8,000, uh, but by around about 1922, 23, Essex County Cricket Club were having a few financial problems. So they sold the ground at Leighton, uh, but continued to lease it. So they raised the money to continue, and they stayed there for another 11 years until 1933. However, there were county matches there until 1977. Like most county cricket clubs, they do a tour of their local counties. So uh, Essex, for example, played at uh, Valentine's Park in Ilford. They played at Leighton. They also played at uh, Colchester, Clacton and uh, Southend, amongst others, um, during their years. So the last match actually played at the county ground Leighton was in August 1977 against Glamorgan. There was one incident that happened in, at the county ground in 1932, in June of 1932, and it is a very famous incident in cricket parlance. Um, now, I had to get this right because it was Essex versus Yorkshire, and Yorkshire's opening batsmen were Percy Holmes and Herbert Sutcliffe, and they put on a record opening partnership of 555. I think it was Sutcliffe who eventually got bowled out and they declared for 555 for one. And they went on to win the match by an innings and quite a few runs at that, that uh, particular match. There is a blue plaque to celebrate this achievement and that is actually on the old pavilion building. These days, it is still a cricket ground for local clubs, but it also doubles up as a concert venue occasionally. Uh, there's been outdoor film festivals there. It's also the start of the local Leighton Carnival. In recent years, they've also uh, had a temporary library set up in there after the old Victorian library in Leighton was undergoing refurbishments. Well, I hope that's given you a little insight to some local history around near me. I hope that inspires you to look at your local uh, history as well and uh, find out what happened long before you were born. Now, if you do like the video, then please give it a like. If you like the channel, please subscribe. And if you want to know when the videos are uploaded, then push the little... Um, there's a little button down there with a bell on it, and that gives you notifications. And if you want to find out what I do when I'm not talking to cameras on my own in my little den, then go to my website, historylord.co.uk, and you can find out about my walking tours of London. Hopefully, they'll be starting again very soon. In the meantime, I'll see you soon. Take care.